we have a backward slide. Okay. Exercise fluency and pronunciation. In speaking, always remember these factors. Checklist for fluency. Practice talking for a considerable long time. Yes. If ever, if you feel so comfortable, you can just talk and talk and talk and release a lot of words in your mouth while you are the only one standing or learning in one space or in one environment that no one can disturb you. Then, next back, so we have talk aloud in English to hear yourself pronounce the words. Okay, obviously, we are targeting about the English language and other areas of learning connected again to English. So always like, am I doing the right thing? So if, if you are so undisturbed of the way you talk, so check the, the, the tuned dictionary, check the correct pronunciation because we have it on the internet and other um, platforms, a very essential and substanti substantial platforms. So, and also we have record yourself speaking on different topic as often as you can for pronunciation. Like that, that is, this is a very good um, factor or a good part of, you know, speaking on how to speak fluently. So in different topics and also time, the time is very important. It is very beautiful if you can have a good talking in a short time or an ample time, but it represents a lot of substance. Then for pronunciation, listen to spoken English, example on radio, TV, and films. Okay, English, just like what I have said, from the, the normal, normal or the usual, like we have from TV, you can also get a lot of good point out from the movies, the films, and the radio, okay, as much as possible. Repeat phrases after the speaker and recordings to help you spell in word groups and use stress and intonation appropriately. Yes. In our debating organization, especially in oration, the stress and intonation really contribute a lot in how are you going to present yourself as a very powerful speaker in front of the crowd or the huge public. The stress and intonation, because even if you have the fabricated piece of like the, the, the power of Eleanor Roosevelt or Margaret Thatcher in their words. So it represents everything, your, your vocal control, how you sound, how you project the word, how you put a life and spirit on what you are talking. Next, we have rec record and listen to yourself speaking as much as you can. So same like record yourself speaking on different topics as often as you can for pronunciation. And again here, record and listen to yourself speaking as much as you can. Next slide, please. Okay. In four macro scales during our college years, Listening is brought up to be the most disregarded point of learning in an English language, or not only in English, but in different fields. We are being tasked during our college years to differentiate what is listening and hearing, right? So hearing is different from listening. Hearing just like you're just projecting sound from your ears, but listening is you accumulate, accumulate a lot of uh, um, sound, sound with substance that will register to your brain. 
So that is how you project listening. If something stayed in your mind, the way you hear, and the next level that is already the listening. So like, make sure you knew exactly what's required for each task and check the instructions. So just like, uh, like the other part or the tip, just like in tip number five. So you are to know what is the required for each task and check the instructions. Then after checking your answers, listen again and try to work out any cost of any problem. Very important, always check and listen again your answer. Don't be, don't be that complacent. So you should always have like the time of, okay. You can also write while you are checking your answer. Okay, and the cause of any problem. Then how to improve? Remember that you only hear the recording once. Don't pause the city when you're practicing. This is very important. Some part of the, the Hello, system. Sir. Yes. Hello, sir. Can you hear me? Yes. Okay. Yes. So, Mr. Miranda, can you please uh, let me bot in for a while? Okay. okay. Everyone, I would like to ask you that we are still using the free um, Zoom Meet. So, any time that this Zoom meeting will cut off, you just need to click the same link so that you can get back here. Uh, we are using the... Okay, so good evening everyone back again. So we will be using the premium on September. Um, our next webinar is on September 1st. So it's actually at the premium one. So we have been plotted all the webinars on August and this webinar is actually um, using the, the, the free trial one. So, okay. Um, where is our webinar speaker? Okay. Hello, Mr. Moreno. Are you still there? Um, can you please unmute your microphone, please, so that I can pin you up? Okay. Okay, I'm here. Okay, sir. Um, can you please Okay, sir. Very good. Okay, let's go back again on the presentation, and then I'll just um, admit some people here on the webinar. Okay, okay. let's continue. Okay, so Okay Are we ready, Sir Mark? Um, hold on for a while, sir. I am um, doing the slideshow for you. Okay Here is it Okay, so can you see it now? Okay, I can, I can see it now, sir. Okay, sir. In this... Okay, so, hello, can you hear me? 
Yes. Ah, ok. 